Hello little scientist welcome to Alan in Telebrain let's meet my two friends today this is Tim and this is Tom i shall tell you some incidents about both my friends and then you guys have to answer some simple questions one day when the traffic light was green i saw Tim crossing the road in a rush now tell me is this a safe habit yes you are correct it is an unsafe habit it is advisable to cross the road only when the traffic light is red now let me tell you about tom one day at tom's home i saw him removing the plug of the electric machines which were not been used is it a safe habit yes absolutely it is a safe habit Today in this video we will play an exciting game of angels and devils and learn about safe and unsafe habits. From your Intelli smart box take out game tokens game toolkit two long stands six stand holders two game board parts and safety cards we need to assemble the base board to keep our game board just like we did in the previous hygiene video remember it Now let's assemble our angels and devils board. For this, you will need the two parts of the game board along with the two joining plates. First, keep the first and the second part together like this. Tilt it down and insert the first joining plate in the notches provided here. Now repeat the same procedure for the second side and insert a joining plate here. Your angels and devils board is now ready. We will place the angels and devils game board on it like this. Perfect. Now to keep it intact we will use the two short stands and place them here in the slits provided. So take a short stand and place it here as you can see that there is a plus sign here so we will put the wooden clip in the plus sign perfect repeat the same procedure for the second side take a short stand and then insert the wooden clip now your game board is all ready now let's observe the safety cards from your safety card box take out the safety cards shuffle them properly and keep them facing downwards as you can see that there are two type of cards safe habits card and unsafe habits card gather the angel tokens devils tokens and the token sticks so let's start a game play let's say i am play 1 and you guys are play 2 now are you all excited to play this game get ready So as player 1 let me pick up the first safety card let's see what we get it says that stay away from the hot objects and steam is it a safe habit or an unsafe habit exactly correct it is a safe habit so as player 1 we will first take the token stick and place it in the first slit of the first row of the white section of player 1 which represents the angel section so let's fix the token stick here and now we will hang the angel token on this token stick like this perfect what if i had got an unsafe habit card for example let's pick a card and see what's written on it It is written that play at construction sites. Oh, it's an unsafe habit. In that case, as player one, I will take the token stick and place it in the first slit of the first row of the red section of player one, which represents the devil. 
and I will fix my token stick here like this and since it is an unsafe habit I will take the devil's token and hang it here got it great now as player 2 let's say it's your turn to pick up the card so come on let's pick a card as player 2 you got a card which shows stay away from open wires is it a safe or an unsafe habit exactly it is a safe habit so let's take the token stick and fix it in the first slit of the first row of the player 2 section of angel and fix the token stick here and then we will hang the angel token on this token stick like this what if as player 2 you get an unsafe habit card in that case you need to take the token stick and place it in the first slit of the first row of the player 2 devil section or the red section and place your token stick here and hang your devil token on it there you go isn't this game very simple in this way player 1 and player 2 continue to play the game they take turns to pick up the cards and observe if it is a safe habit or an unsafe habit card and they fix the angel or the devil token in the correct section of the game board remember once a row is filled with either angel or the devil token you can move on to the next row fixing the tokens row by row will help you easily know which player has more tokens in which section the players continue to play till all the cards are picked up. In the end, each player must count the number of angels token and the number of devils token in their own section. After counting, you can know that which player has the larger angels army and which player has the larger devils army. Since good always wins over evil, the player with larger angels army wins the game. Isn't that exciting? Remember, safe habits are like angels in our life, keeping us away from harm. And unsafe habits are like the devils in our life, always harming us. So, we should definitely have more angels or safe habits in our life. After playing this fun and exciting angels and devils game, you will now have understood what are safe habits and what are unsafe habits. Visualize science with IntelliBrain and fall in love with learning. Thank you.